Hello everyone, I'm Rich Noonan for Hometown Builder Television, a program in which we travel all over America in search of our nation's best builders. But today, we focus on a company that is so much more than a home builder. The Howdigy story begins with architecture and design, and it ends with homes that are simply incredible. This is the Howdigy story. The name is Howdigy Architecture Interior Designs and Construction. It is well known in the major markets of Texas, Houston, Dallas, Austin, and lots of places in between. Stunning homes such as this one on the banks of Lake Austin say a lot about the Howdigy body of work, but Howdigy clients say much more. Luis would come and his team and meet us and set up an appointment with us and meet us here in the woodlands, so it worked out perfect. And he had it all uh, when we compared him to other uh, architects in town. Uh, they could talk to a piece of it, like the, pro uh, the process, but really couldn't articulate the whole uh, input process and output, and Harry, he could. We spoke to several Howdigy clients, and all of them said the same thing. It was simply a joy to work with this firm. It puts such an emphasis on proper design first, and then we'll build an incredible home and even provide unmatched interior design services. In other words, Howdigy is a one-stop company. Sonette Austin and her family loved that. They watched their in-laws build this stunning home in the woodlands outside of Houston. And they saw a big difference in the Howdigy process compared to other builders. It's like night and day. Sonette and her husband Duke asked Howdigy to build them a very family-friendly lake house that they could really enjoy with their four children and lots of friends. That was the wonderful part. Uh, my husband and I met with Luis and we sat down and we started telling him exactly what we envisioned for the lake home. And it was incredible. He just sat down and started drawing as we were talking. And it was amazing to me because on the piece of paper that he was drawing on was exactly what we wanted. That might be the key differentiator with Howdigy and just about everyone else we've ever seen. Luis Howdigy and his team are design experts. He is a very talented and experienced architect first. The first part of quality is good design. Then as you move beyond, obviously there's a lot of more obvious components to quality. When once you have the element, which is good design, um, the rest of it falls into place very easily. The Howdigy design process almost always begins with a discussion with Susan Howdigy. She is the first point of contact for prospective clients. Typically in the, uh, the usual process of custom building, you would normally have a separate building entity, uh, you're working with an architect independently, and an interior designer. And all of those entities will have um, a lot of uh, questions and finger pointing um, along the way. Um, with our company, you just uh, uh, don't have that at all. We, we are able to document all of the uh, details of architecture and interior selections and finishes during the design phase. And so by the time we get into construction, everything is um, on paper in black and white, it's costed, it's, um, it's our contract with our clients, and essentially it eliminates the need for change orders unless the client is looking to do something different. Susan is a true, gentle, guiding force for clients, some of whom have never built a custom home before, and they have no idea what it's all about. Mamta Pasha and her husband Raza were in the middle of an incredible build of a Howdigy home in Houston when we met them. Look at this stunning home that we shot during construction. Stone everywhere you look, outside and inside. The Pashas are very busy people. He has a medical practice. She's an attorney and they are raising three young children while they build this incredible Tuscan style home. This is clearly the Pasha's dream home, but they did not want the design build to be a nightmare. So they called Howdigy. The Best. doors on the girls' rooms are incredible. We were in Dr. Pasha's office one day when members of the Howdigy design team brought in several samples. It was amazing to watch. Many big decisions were made. The granite, paint colors, flooring. It was easy and fun for the Pashas. <laughs> the designers are so full of great ideas, even using an iPad to show the Pasha's really cool design elements. This is really a special one-stop shopping experience that you just don't find elsewhere. My wife and I have been looking for architects and design team for a long, long time. And we chose this team because of the fact that they're so comprehensive in the way that they, they, they approach design. Uh, you, be, you begin with the architectural drawings 
and then you go you, you go through the design process all the way to picking you know light fixtures. Uh, that one-stop shop is very convenient for my wife and I, especially if you're short on time. Uh, they come with a big team. Um, we will discuss you know lamp lighting for an hour. The next time they're coming in, they're talking about tiles. So everything's presented to you in a way that it's very easy for you to choose which direction you want to go. I think that they have been in the business for so many years that they have all the right people in all the right places uh, to help us build if we need to make a certain selection for a blue countertop, a blue granite countertop, they know exactly where to get it from. If I have pulled a picture from a 14th century cathedral in Spain and I say design me a roof that looks like this, they know exactly where to go to get the finishing done for that. They have just been so professional that when I tell them something, when I send them an email, it's returned within the next hour. One of the reasons for that is that Houdigui might be the most prepared firm in the nation. Before the Poshas got their visit, the design team had laid out everything in minute detail on a big table at Houdigui's Austin headquarters. In the Poshas, it's a really eclectic project. When you spend any time here, you feel a real creative energy. The Houdigui team is on the cutting edge with a great mix of experience. It is fascinating to listen to a Houdigui design meeting. You see that mix of design and tradition, state-of-the-art computer work. For example, at this design meeting, there was a stunning hand-drawn rendering of a home, while in another Houdigui building across the courtyard, two young designers worked with the latest, greatest 3D computer programs. Houdigui has people in very specialized positions. To make design and builds go smoothly, for example, designer Crystal Montalongo, she works with the design team. The clients never see her, but she acts as a kind of liaison between the architects and the designers to make sure that all the beautiful design features work with the space. I just think they're trying to fill every niche, make sure there's as much information as we can get to the client and they fully know what they're getting. They're seeing that that deco uh, in the stair or the exact size of the lighting picture and the shape so they can see how it's gonna feel in the space and that everything's working, there's no surprises. Stephen Grant is a building information modeling manager at Houdigui. What does that mean? Well, he helps to coordinate 3D drafting. His work allows a Houdigui client to walk through their home essentially on that computer before ground is ever broken. Uh, when you have a client in front of you or you're presenting the material, you can easily click on one object, for instance, windows. Windows might need to be larger or smaller or adjust the head height of the windows. You can do that very quick and efficiently. Jessica Schmier is a Houdigui project manager. She is a degreed interior designer with a minor in architecture and years of experience. She loves the culture at Houdigui. I have the best job here, if you ask me. Um, I work cl closely with our clients uh, in making selections, doing change orders, and then I work with their team, their architects that are on their project, their interior designer. Uh, of course, I work with Louise and Susan, uh, and uh, like I said, I think I have the best job here. Jessica is the liaison between the clients and the Houdigui team once the build begins. Another specialized job that most firms like this would never have. But Houdigui does not skimp on staff, and that means something to clients. So does the Houdigui passion. People love to work for this firm. I'm very proud to work here. I'm very proud to say that I work here, and I am proud of Houdigui. Dwayne and Kimberly Radke had moved all over the world, but had never built a custom home. They called Houdigui. The result was an incredible English manor style home in the woodlands. Dwayne spent his career as an engineer. He really cared about the bones of a Houdigui home. But what impressed us particularly was in the structural side when you looked at it, just the, the, the bulk of both the concrete and the, the wood and the floor, where people might put in five or six beams, they had a dozen beams. I mean, it would, so you, you felt very comfortable on, on the quality of the base. Dwayne and Kimberly surely needed that strong base because they put lots of stone in their home. Look at this incredible kitchen, top quality stonework everywhere you look. Kimberly says, as much as anything else, dealing with Susan, Luis, and the entire Houdigui team was simply fantastic. They're approachable, um, they're talented, they build a very good product, very structurally sound, um, and a beautiful interior. 
The Radke home is full of specialized, one-of-a-kind details. Look at this incredible bar and a second-floor game room just off the home theater. The Radkes looked high and low for a bar that would give them that English pub feeling. Finally, Luis Houdigy said, how about we just build it for you? And the Houdigy craftsmen got to work. The result is stunning. <laughs> Martha Austin and her husband would say the same thing. Their Howdigy home in the Woodlands is stunning. The Austins had hired a very well-known architect before they met with Luis, but they did not really connect with the plans that they got from him. Finally, they asked Luis Howdigy to take a look, and they were very glad that they did. We sat down with him, and um, my husband and I met with him, and I think Susan was there the first day, and it, the meeting couldn't have gone any better. He just sketched out, um, he looked at our plans first, and. He kind of showed us some things that he thought were major uh, problems with it, actually, and we kind of agreed with him. And uh, so he sketched out a plan for us that we loved, and uh, it, it just went from there, and it went quickly, actually. Martha's home has a wonderful wide open floor plan. The beams in the great room give this home such a warm feeling the moment you walk in the front door. There are lots of rounded arches and plenty of unbelievable stone, wood, and tile work everywhere you look. It was no accident. Martha and her husband were simply blown away when they saw the meticulous design process by the Howdigy team unfold before their eyes during the first selections meeting. The first time that I went down to see the selections that the design team had, had selected, uh, I didn't know what to expect, but they had put them all out on the conference room table for me, and I, I was very excited about that because I, I didn't know. I didn't know what to expect. And this sounds silly, but it, it just, it almost took my breath away because it was so beautiful. All, every tile, everything was, was perfect. Sinet had the same experience with the Austin Lake House. Howdigy's lead designer, Susie, has an incredible eye, and it shows. We were going to decorate it ourselves, and she came in and said, just let me see if we, I can do this for you. And immediately, she got me. She knew exactly what my taste was, and she made it so nice. The day we moved in, everything was already set up for us. Susie had everything there for us. We didn't have to add to it. Susie and the Howdigy design team are on the cutting edge. Howdigy has lots of high profile, high achieving clients. Many such as tennis star Andy Roddick and his wife actress Brooklyn Decker, New York Yankee Vernon Wells and many others are on the road a lot. They don't have a lot of time to build a big custom home. Howdigy clients love that Susie and the design team will use every tool at their disposal to keep them informed. I wanna show you some of the accessories that we found we saw Susie using FaceTime to show a client some samples for approval. You gotta love it. Most of our clients um, really see the advantage of hiring us for their furnishings uh, because we're working with the architect so closely and we're, we're the one making the interior selection so we're able to harmonize the entire space. Um, we're able to say I want this chest in this niche, so let's make this niche, you know, 42 inches wide uh, to accommodate this piece of furniture. So it's all very integrated. You can see that level of detail in every Howdigy home. In Sunette's Lake Austin house, for example, look at the built-in bunk beds for the kids. Just perfect. The Radkeys love this piece of furniture that had traveled with them through their lives, so it was designed right into the home plan. The space was built just to fit this piece. These are the types of things that can become a real problem with a traditional home builder, not at Howdigy, which offers such a different experience. In fact, a Howdigy design is about as thick as a book. No stone is left unturned. Alan Christensen has been looking at lots of drawings lately. Howdigy is designing and building him a 9,000 square foot home on an urban lot in Houston. Alan is a super detailed guy. He's an IT consultant. He says he interviewed every big name architect in Houston before choosing Howdigy. And the reason why is the products we've seen him delivering his team is just amazing. Uh, it stands out uh, from all the other uh, high-end custom de uh, developers in town. Uh, uh, interviewed a bunch of good architects in Houston, uh, but no one really comes close to hierarchy. 
him and Susan are just great people too, right? You know, very warm and very caring. One of the things that the Haudegui team cares most about is being transparent, very cost conscious, and being a good steward to a client's money, which again comes back to great design. We are careful always with square footage and, and cost. Um, that's one of the things that I'm very proud of that we bring to the table is a very good understanding of cost. Uh, that's an important element of a good design. Luis, Susan, Susie, and the entire Haudegui team across the state of Texas love to say this, design rules. It is so clear that one of the reasons that Haudegui is one of America's best is because the emphasis has been on design for four decades and will be in the future. Haudegui, integrity, a great team, and decades of building beautiful homes one design at a time. For Hometown Builder Television, I'm Rich Noonan. Thank you for your time.